If you are here, it means you are ready to go to the next level and monetize your website. So take a deep breath and let me introduce you to the most intelligent ad system you have ever met. In newspaper theme, we have built a system designed to avoid ad blindness and give you the best results concerning both revenue and user experience. In this tutorial, we'll show you how to use one of the most popular advertising platforms, AdSense by Google. We'll also explain how to use custom HTML ads, also known as banner ads. Let's start by placing an ad in a predefined spot like the header. Go to the Newspaper, Theme Panel, Ads panel and open the Header Ad section. Copy the code from your AdSense account and paste it here. By default, the ads are visible across all devices, but you can disable the ones you don't need. Save the settings and the theme will automatically bring you the right size of ad from the Google system and display it on your header. This intelligent system comes with 14 predefined ad spots for sections like header, sidebar, inside articles, and some post templates, and smart lists, above footer, or as a clickable background. Now let's insert an AdSense ad in a post. We'll use the inline ad predefined spot. Go to the Newspaper, Theme Panel, Ads panel and paste your AdSense code in the designated area. For the inline ads, you can set up a particular location and the position. Choose the number of paragraphs the theme should display before showing the ad and the desired position. Now, just save the settings and you are all set. Pretty slick. Do you need to display an advertisement in a place that is not predefined in the theme? Great! Newspaper allows you to define up to five custom ads and place them in any location inside your pages. Let's open Newspaper, Theme Panel, Ads and click the Custom Ad section. Just like we did before, insert your AdSense code in the designed area and save the settings. Now open the page where this ad should be displayed and edit it with TD Composer. Find the desired location on your page and click the Add Element button. From the list, drag and drop the ad box where you want. Click the newly added block and under the General tab select Use Ad Spot Custom Ad. Hit the Save button and your first custom ad is right there where you want it. What if you want to promote an event or a product on your website and you only have an HTML banner or just an image? Well, we've got you covered. The newspaper theme ad system will read the non-AdSense code and render the image just as you uploaded it. Just make sure that the banner image has the optimal aspect ratio. If you upload a square image in a rectangular ad spot, you won't get the results you are hoping for. You should use pre-edited images of the right size and shape for each device separately. Newspaper gives you complete control over your non-AdSense ads, allowing you to tweak the design and fine-tune its behavior on different devices. You can choose which ad version will be displayed on which device. Let me show you how easy it is. Upload your new ads using Media button. Now go to Newspaper Theme Panel Ads and open the Header Ad section. If you click here, the link will open the newspaper documentation where you'll find the needed HTML code. It must respect this form with four divs containing four images and four URLs, one for each device. Copy the example. Now insert your landing page link here and the links to your edited images here. Save the settings. Yes, monetizing with newspaper is that simple. Remember, the adverts may influence the user experience and the performance of your website. The trick is to keep the fine balance between content and advertising and give your visitors an unforgettable website to come back to. Thanks for watching.